Eric Holder Jr., the nation's first black U.S. Attorney General, is preparing to announce his resignation Thursday after a tumultuous tenure marked by civil rights advances, national security threats, reforms to the criminal justice system, and five and a half years of fights with Republicans in Congress. Two sources familiar with the decision tell NPR that Holder, 63, intends to lead the Justice Department as soon as his successor is confirmed, a process that could run through 2014 and even into next year. A former U.S. government official says Holder has been increasingly adamant about his desire to leave soon for fear that he otherwise could be locked in to stay for much of the rest of President Obama's second term. Holder already is one of the longest serving members of the Obama cabinet and ranks as the fourth longest tenured AG in history. Hundreds of employees waited in line stacked three rows deep in early February 2009 to witness his return to the Justice Department where he previously worked as a young corruption prosecutor and as Deputy Attorney General, the second in command during the Clinton administration.